Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write java program to display factors of a number in java so guys basically in this program we will learn to display all factors of a given number using a loop in java so basically what is a factor it is any number that divides the given number perfectly so what will be the logic we will be using the percent operator in order to check whether the remainder is zero or not so basically let's say for example if the number that is entered by the user is 60 so what are the factors so these are all the factors that's because these numbers can divide this number that is 60 perfectly in which case the percent operator will give us the remainder as zero so guys let us move to the eclipse id in order to implement this logic so first of all we will ask the user to enter the number inside this number variable so we will say print statement over here and we will ask the user to enter number so enter number over here and then we will use the scanner class in order to take the input from the user you can use any other class in order to take the input from the user buffered reader class can also be used in order to take the input from the user so it depends on your preference over here and then we will be having number variable followed by sc dot next int over here so guys this is the line of code that is responsible in order to take the input from the user and assign it to this number variable now guys how do we find the factors as i have told you we will be using the for loop and then the integer it will go from i it is equal to 1 up to i less than or equal to the number that is being entered by the user and i plus plus so over here what we will check is whether this number that is i can perfectly divide this entered number by the user so we will say if this number that is entered by the user percent i is it equal to zero if yes then we will simply print this number now guys how do we print this number basically we are going to get all the factors in a single line that is in this way so how do we do this over here outside the for loop we will have the print statement first we will remove this ln part and then over here i will say factors of this number and then we have colon and then one at a time we have to print all the numbers over here so simply i will have another print statement over here and then i'll remove this ln part and then over here i will say i and then followed by we should have the space character so that all the numbers must be separated by the space characters over here so guys this is the very simple logic number percent i if it is equal to zero then that number that is i is the factor of the entered number and it will be printed over here if it is not zero then the control flow will go to the next number up to the number that is being entered by the user so guys let me just save this file and try running this code now so let's say we take the same example enter number it is equal to 60 and then when we press enter it says factors of this number it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 so as you can see 1 can divide 60 2 3 4 5 6 all can divide 60 now the next number that is 7 it cannot divide 60 that is why it is not in this list 8 and 9 can also not divide 60 10 can divide 60 so 10 is there in the list 11 cannot divide so 11 is not present then we have 12 and then we have 15 20 30 and then in the end 60 which can divide that number itself so guys this is the very simple logic in order to find the factors of the number as far as mathematics is concerned let me just run this code once again we will check another example let's say 49 is the number so when we press enter as you can see 1 can divide 49 7 can divide 49 since 7 multiplied by 7 is 49 and then in between there are no other numbers which can divide 49 and then in the end we have 49 which can divide the number itself so guys only three factors we have for this number guys let us run this code once again and let us provide one prime number over here so let's say when we enter 11 which is one of the prime numbers and when we press enter as you can see one can divide that same number that is 11 and 11 itself can divide the same number that is 11 there is no other number which can divide this number and that is why this number is called as prime number so based on this logic can you find what will be the factors of the number that is being entered by the user as 23 please comment below your answers which will be the factors of this number that is 23 please make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notification on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is a java program to make a simple calculator using the switch case so stay tuned